So composite bonding is definitely trending in the world of dentistry at the moment. It's my most popular treatment. It's the treatment I get asked the most questions about. Um, but let's not forget about ceramic veneers. Now, everybody kind of has this phobia of them, like, oh my God, it's gonna mean having to have my tooth shaved into tiny pegs. But the reality is it's just not like that anymore. The materials are so strong now that we can use them in very thin section. And although we do have to take a tiny amount of tooth away, often because ceramic veneers last so long, so we're talking more like 10 to 15 years in comparison to three to five years, it can actually be the healthiest treatment into the future because you don't need to have repeated treatments. Um, they also maintain looking their absolute best um, for that time. They don't pick up stains like composite can, they don't tend to chip and wear, um, and they can be made to look extremely natural. We're talking like translucencies, tints, um, just the most natural looking um, replica of a tooth that you can imagine can only be achieved with ceramic veneers. Um, so there is still a place for it um, and I definitely still talk a lot to my patients about it and a lot of my patients still do choose to go down the route of ceramic veneers. So although composite bonding is, is a great option for majority of people, don't forget about ceramic veneers. <laughs> and if you haven't already, please head over to our website, um, sign up to the VIP waitlist where you can get exclusive access to our first appointments when they become available. You can see some examples of ceramic veneer cases and prices, um, and you can get exclusive VIP discounts when you sign up and join the list. Um, so any questions? pop them in the comments and I'll see you soon.